Hello everyone, my name is Ange. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my mini series where I'm trying to speed run the Ghost Hunter career in The Sims 3. So our last episode, it may not have gone very well. Um, we got robbed, possibly twice, technically once. You can go back and watch that episode if you're a bit confused. Um, but yeah, we got robbed and we don't even have a full house. So I think the next thing that we have to get ourselves is a burglar alarm. So I sent her to the gym to have a shower because we don't have a shower at our house. And the one spot that we did have to clean ourselves, our sink got stolen. Luckily, Bonnie lives right down the street from the gym. So it's not that far for her to go shower. And now she has this moodlet stuff taken. Sims really like their stuff. And when someone grabs it, they take it quite personally from seeing a burglar. And also from getting your stuff taken. And after this, I'm just gonna send her home. Oh my gosh. And we have $9 in bills that we have to pay. Well, let's pay our $9 in bills. And I take my whole $9. Even though I just got robbed. We don't got no insurance on that sink. We don't even got insurance on our house. We don't even got a full house. Like, this burglar had it so easy. Okay, well... Let's just, you know, use the toilet and go to sleep. And it takes her energy so long to fill up because we have this shitty bed. Oh boy. Okay, we work again tonight. Hopefully we can get at least one more promotion. And we have the whole weekend off, which kind of sucks. Don't worry guys, we have a roof, we're fine. Oh my God, wait, what is this? She's sweating profusely. Oh my God. She's sweating like a snake at a bake sale. Oh, goodness. Okay. That is really not good. Oh, because it's 31 degrees out. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, You know what? We don't even have to have a quick meal. We have all this stuff in our inventory. We want to eat a couple grapes. Cool down? How do I cool down? Your sim wants to find some shade and cool off. We're literally underneath a roof. I don't know what more shade we could have. Okay, her social is really low. Um, is there anybody at the gym? There's a car here. Oh, look at there's people at the gym. Let's go talk to somebody. Oh, we got Haley, Dee Dee, or Alice. Okay, well, let's talk to Haley because she's right here and doesn't seem busy. Oh, look, she's wearing into this nice little fairy skirt. Maybe we can get Bonnie to play some chess before work. Because playing chess helps with her fun, but also it increases her job experience. Okay, it looks like we got two jobs. Paranormal investigation and a poltergeist haunting. What? Have I done that one yet? Have I done a poltergeist haunting yet? I don't think I have. Oh, we have another one. Spirit invasion. Okay, maybe it, it wasn't done telling us them all yet. <gasps> okay, yes, we've got three to do today. That is really good. Okay, so we got our paranormal investigation. We did that before. The poltergeist haunting. We have not done that yet. And the spirit invasion. Okay. Let's go do the spirit invasion, get that out of the way, and then maybe do the poltergeist haunting second, and then go do the paranormal investigation last. Because we, we know what that one is. That one's boring. But poltergeist haunting, that sounds fun. Na 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 It's Bonnie! I'm never saying anything in front of my mirror anymore. I think I said a magical word, and now my home is full of spirits. Catch them, please. <gasps> of course I will. I don't see any in your actual house, though. Although your house is green, which is kind of fun. Um, maybe we shouldn't just chat to him, Bonnie. Bonnie. Maybe we could like banish these spirits. Go, Bonnie. Oh, we only need to banish three here. Easy. Okay, can you get out of our way? That guy was seriously just standing right in our way that entire time. Okay, we got two. We just need one more. Banish? Where is she going? Did she find it? Oh, she found it by herself? Bonnie, you're so good! Oh, is it up in the attic? Oh, it is up in their attic! Oh, look at the McDuffs. They've got like, look, they got this whole witchy attic up here. Mm-hmm. Get it, Bonnie. 
I think I just realized like my desktop audio was way too loud. I don't know how it got up that high. So if the music was too loud in the beginning of this, I, I do apologize. Oh, what is this? It's one thing to lurk in cemeteries hoping to spy a stray spirit. It's entirely another to trapeze into the building unaccompanied and go ahead. Oh, and go head to head with an angry poltergeist. City Hall admires your courage and wants to thank you for ridding the buildings on Moonlight Falls for their, of their paranormal entities. Please stop by City Hall to receive the Ghost Hunter Spirit Medal. We got another award. Oh my God, we got another award. Bonnie, you're amazing. You are truly amazing, Bonnie. Okay, what else do these pop-ups say? Did we get promoted? The spirits didn't seem too dangerous, but they were certainly unsettling. Thanks for taking care of them. No problem. And then those are the spirits that we captured. Okay. Oh, we're about to get promoted. We are about to get promoted. Look at that. Donate 50 spirits to science. Of course we can. Contemplate the meaning of meaning. All right. Well, instead of doing that, maybe we could go do um, this poltergeist haunting. <gasps> Let's go deal with the poltergeist. Guys, we've never done this before. This is new for Bonnie. Exercise objects. Exercise objects? Wait, it's red in here. Wait a second. There are poltergeists everywhere. Why did they pick my home? Why? Stop them, please. <gasps> oh, who are these lovely people? Miriam Hopcraft and James Hopcraft with their lovely little fairy child, Alfred Hopcraft. Okay. So we gotta come in here and exercise objects. Um, I think it's quite obvious which objects are um, haunted, are possessed. She's doing it by herself. I don't even have to tell her to do this. She's just doing this autonomously. Like she was born to be a ghost hunter. Oh. Yeah, you get that spirit. Oh, good job, Bonnie. Okay, we got another one over here. You want to get this one? Oh, oh, look what happened to happen. Okay, congratulations. Bonnie has been conferred the new title of Seance Holder by the Moonlight Falls Town Council in recognition of her valuable contribu contributions to the workforce. Spirit detection technology has come a long way in the last few years, and as an official seance holder, you've been certified to use a spookometer. Okay. With this new tool, unruly spirits and ghosts don't stand a chance at hiding from you. Whip it out when you mean business. Bonnie Green can now scan for spirits with the new ghost positioning system. Wayward spirits can run, but they can't hide. Does that mean we can like go places and look for spirits? wait that's really cool oh that means does that mean we can like work while we're not working because like see how we how we have saturday and sunday off like because we can go scan for spirits now can we like you know be on the job while we're not on the job oh i'm interested look for spirits oh she wants to do that we can definitely do that oh bonnie just got promoted a moment she will always recall fondly for all the hard work that went into it yeah all the hard work look at look at you look at you doing all this hard work banishing these these ghosts oh did that one not work i don't think that one actually worked okay go to the go to the oven again okay we got that one good job bonnie where's the next one upstairs oh the bookcase okay haunted bookcase go get it bonnie oh <gasps> she couldn't get it see she didn't get it and then it went and possessed the bed get it bonnie it can't escape you are you booing me rude miriam i just like depossessed your house that was rude thanks i don't think my belongings could take much more of that thrashing you're the best really because you were just booing me that was rude all right last one let's go do this paranormal investigation and then um uh, we can go sell all of the spirits that we have we have six spirits I was gonna say hopefully we'll have enough to buy a burglar alarm today, but I don't know if we will. How come we made so much money the first night? What's going on here? Okay, so she's gonna go do a community investigation. 
something dead has gone horribly wrong inside rush inside and set things straight all right go for it bonnie you got this she just says this one by herself so we're just gonna speed through oh she is so hungry my poor girl okay we got some stuff in our pocket we can eat look at those horses trotting by oh god nice job paranormal problems are no match for you of course they're not it's bonnie okay have um have some grapes and potatoes there bonnie see yeah that filled her right up okay now where do we go get our service go collect that service award girl go collect your trophy or medal or whatever we got so this is the first one we got this honor trophy that's the one we got before so i'm interested to see if we'll get just the same one or a different one this time i hope it's a different one i want her to have a whole collection we can make her a little shelf for all her awards oh my god it's an actual medal wait a second look it, it's it says epic hero medal oh my god we need to hang that on her wall it says hello bonnie i've been hearing your name a lot lately your ghost hunting expertise has been put to good use you have aided many citizens by clearing the spooks off their property in gratitude for your efforts to serve the community of moonlight falls we here at city hall are very pleased to present you with the ghost hunter's spirit medal display it proudly on your wall we're also giving you a medal you can wear she gets a medal she can wear now too bonnie we are moving up in the world girl you should be so proud of yourself look she definitely is she's like i have accomplished so much today i am accomplishing my dreams okay i am so proud of her let's go sell those ghosts to the science facility okay science lab donate spirits and we got 238 for donating those spirits all right head home we might be able to afford a burglar alarm but like just be able to afford i think it's like 900 and something simoleons okay yeah so we've got 1164 simoleons um <laughs> we will not be able to fix this i don't think because we have to buy ourselves a burglar alarm apparently which is okay it's not 900 it's 895 simoleons okay so we'll put that right there and now we have 269 simoleons left um i think we could get another piece of wall i don't know if we could afford a door piece of wall okay that was 70 simoleons we have 199 left there's got to be a door for cheaper than 199 oh my gosh 75 that's the cheapest one we've also got this round em up door with a um one second let me show you with a horse on the front of the door that's really nice maybe not maybe not bonnie style i really like this one but i don't really want to spend our full one one i don't want to spell a full 100 you know there's this one for 85. i really like this door though what if I splurged a little bit and got us this nice door? It's like our only decor in the whole place and it serves as a window for us. See, it's a double. It's a door and a window. And you know what? I can even give us some free. There's um a free wall covering. This one here, it costs zero simoleons. It doesn't look very good, but hear me out. Maybe we can change the door to black and green because black and green is her favorite color combo. Okay, so I can give her this free wallpaper and we'll do the same thing on the inside so she's not sad that it's not um, like decorated. Okay, this isn't too bad. Let's see if we can get her a light in here. We have 94 simoleons left. Oh yeah, look at this. We can get one of these little bare bulb Spartan lightings. One of these little pull lights, the pull string lights. I love these lights. Let's get that in black for her. There you go, look at that. Now she can even see. All right, and we have 54 simoleons left, but you know what? We have a burglar alarm, okay? And that was what we needed. <laughs> we have our burglar alarm. We have our 895 simoleon burglar alarm. You know, we could have gotten so, so much other furniture with that. That's like actually functional furniture, but that's fine. This is what we needed. All right, I'm going to have her clean this toilet and then use it and just go straight to sleep. And then maybe tomorrow when she wakes up, we can try to scan for spirits somewhere. I'd like to maybe try and go to the library and do it and see what happens. Because we know there's a spirit at the library. 
This is what Bonnie's little house looks like from the outside right now. Okay, I'll let her have a quick meal today. We don't have a sink anymore. Oh my God, that sucks. Okay, so I'm gonna let her have a quick meal and then send her to the gym again. Whoa, look at this nice car. So I'm gonna send her to the gym for another shower. Um, and then, you know, she can talk to somebody. Maybe play some chess. Oh, and she had a bad night's sleep from sleeping on a cheap bed. Uh, let's come up here and talk to Serena. She looks nice. Hey, Serena. Nice to meet you. Let's ask about her career. Let's get to know her. Okay, Serena's unemployed. Very good. Well, I'm a ghost hunter. If you're ever looking for a job, there's always ghosts around town. Oh, she's a hopeless romantic. Okay. She's an Aries. And she's in a relationship with some guy named Rick. Okay. Is Rick here? Is Rick here today? Waylon, Doreen, David, Dwayne. I don't see any I don't see any Rick around. Talk about shared traits. Oh, we're both over emotional. That's so nice. That's not what I meant. Um scan for spirits. There we go. Scan for spirits. Let's see if there's any spirits in the gym. <gasps> Wait, that's so cool. Did we find any? What happened? Did we not find any? Did we find any? Did we not find any? I don't think we found any. Um, let me have her play some chess really quick. Just to get her fun need up. And I'd like to go to the library and see if we can find any ghosts there. I don't know. I don't really know how this like scanning thing works. I kind of just want to go around and try and scan a bunch of different places. Okay, well, we have to go to the bathroom. So let's go use the bathroom down here. Ew. Oh, everyone's everyone's a witch. Serena's for sure a witch. Well, no wonder why I liked her. Except I did just watch her make a poison apple. That's kind of scary. Oh, is our scanner working? Okay. Okay, scanning, scanning. No, zero. Okay, zero ghosts. Okay, I see a little thing that pops up. It says zero. Okay, I got to pay attention to that. Let's go. Where's the library? I want to go to the library. Yeah, come here and scan for spirits. Oh. No. No, no spirits. Okay. Can we scan for spirits over here? No spirits. Well, Bonnie, you you've just like you've you've you're so good at your job. There's just no more spirits left in the town. Let's go try the basement of the library. Zero. I wonder if we like go scan all of the rooms. Like, is it gonna d change with each room? You have to do it by room. I feel like I'm in phasmophobia right now. No, no ghosts. Okay, so it actually does the entire lot. So I'm silly and I just wasted a bunch of time. Let's go try the park before we go home. Okay, let's go scan for spirits at the park before we go home. It does have to be nighttime to scan for spirits as well. Just checking for some spirits in the rain here. Any spirits in the thunder? Hello? Oh, her scanner isn't even working because it's raining. No ghosts. Okay. Okay, I'm going to send Bonnie home so she can eat and go to sleep. She, she can just have some canned soup and sleep. With all her dirty plates on the floor. Oh my goodness, Bonnie, you poor thing. Okay, so we are now level five in the Ghost Hunter career. We are halfway there. So I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this episode. I guess it's not so much of a speed run anymore. It's just like a nice little mini series. Anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying it. I am sure enjoying it. I freaking love this. All right, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye.